Here are the solutions to our July numeracy form challenge. Okay, question one, we have nine. Question two, 132. Question three, 151. Question four, 64. Question five, 42. Question six, 1.5. Question seven is eight. Question eight, 3,611. Question nine is seven. And question 10, 7,238.2. Part two. 1 is negative 1, 2 is 1, 3 is 2, 4 is 9, 5 is 20, 6 is 4, 7 is 3, 8 is 56.36, 9 is 2 thirds and 10 is 13. Part 3, question 1 is 8, question 2 is 11.18 a.m. Question 3 is 10.24 a.m. Question 4 is 3. Question 5 is 10. Question 6 is 3. Question 7 is no. Question 8 is yes. Question 9 is 1,000. And question 10 is 81. It's the end of part 3. Part 4. Okay, so we're playing a game called 36. We need to use all four numbers to get 36. Right, first question. If we do 6 multiplied by 3 and then we add 9 multiplied by 2, we get 36. Part 2, 14 subtract 8 gives us 6. And then 6 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 3 gives us 36. And the third one... 6 multiplied by 7 gives us 42. And then if we subtract 7 and add 1, or subtract 6, we get 36. Let's move on to part 5. Same sorts of questions, a little bit more challenging. So question 4. We have 6 multiplied by 3, that gives us 18. 18 divided by 1 half is the same as 18 multiplied by 2, and that gives us 36. Okay, question 5. 19 plus 5 plus 4 gives me 28, and if I subtract negative 8, that's the same as adding positive 8, and that gives me 36. Finally, question 6. If I do 0 0.7 multiplied by 10, that gives me 7. 7 multiplied by 4 is 28. Add on the 8, gives us 36. Okay, for the dingbats, we have a cuboid, cuboid and a cord for the second dingbats teaser. Finally, question 7. Right, so we want the largest two-digit prime where each of the digits are also prime. So I can't have the largest number, which is 97, because we know that 9 is not a prime number. Equally, I can't have 83 or 89 because we know that 8 is not a prime number. So now we need to look at the numbers starting with 7. I have a choice of 71. 73 or 79. Again, I can't have 79 because 9 is not a prime number. So the largest number available to me is 73. Now, if I look at the smallest prime numbers, I can't have 11 or 13 or 17 because 1 is not a prime number. So the smallest number, starting with 2, is 23. Then I simply do 73, subtract 23, gives me the answer of 50. That's it. Thank you very much and have a fantastic summer break. This will be your last numeracy challenge during form time. Thanks very much. Bye-bye.